Okay guys, I've only got time for a very quick cup of coffee with you. So please just pause the video, uh, get yourself a nice cup of joe, tea, uh, Coca-Cola, whatever you're drinking, and I'm gonna tell you about something very, very quickly. Okay, have you got your drink? Now, what some of you will know is if you follow our main channel, Off The Curb Ministries, in 2021, we did a massive project and we called it World Evangelism Day. Now, let me just stop you there. Before you say every day should be World Evangelism Day, I believe that with all of my heart and I try to live it out. I, I really do try to preach the gospel every single day as much as possible. Uh, I spend my life telling people about the Lord Jesus Christ. And can I challenge you? Do you do that yourself? Do you try and make every day World Evangelism Day? That's a great thing, okay? Now, what is World Evangelism Day though? What, what am I trying to say? I, although we should use every opportunity to preach the gospel, I also think there is a real power, a real strength, and I hope you can agree with this. If all of us from around the world, all the different people, I have people who watch the videos in America, uh, that's the, the biggest audience, then we have uh, the UK, then we have India, we have South Africa, the Philippines, um, Singapore, Canada, all around the world, there's people who watch these videos. Do you not think it would be marvellous if we can all come together and build on each other's strengths and say for one day, as much as possible, we're going to try and spread the gospel and work together and see what we can all achieve in 24 hours. Do you not think that sounds like a good idea? Well, I personally think it's a, a wonderful thing to do. And in 2021, uh, we did this. We we took, the day we've chosen is, is Black Friday. Now I believe Black Friday this year for 2024 is the 29th of November at 2024. On the 29th of November, Black Friday, just like we did uh, in 2021, I really would love it if we can go out and share the gospel. Why have we chosen that day? Well, as you know, on Black Friday, many people are going out and they're shopping. The town centres, the, the shopping malls, um, the local grocery stores, they're all very, very busy. And why don't we stand outside these places with a big bundle of tracks and give them out to try and spread the good news? Now, if you would like a track to use for that day, I actually wrote a specific one, which is called my Black Friday tract, and it talks about a Black Friday that happened 2,000 years ago, except for this deal is totally free. You see, the Son of God, it says in the Bible, between uh, the sixth hour and the ninth hour, darkness fell on the land, and we know that Jesus Christ on the cross, everything went black, it went dark on that Good Friday, and there the Lord Jesus Christ died for our sins, and this deal is totally totally free. If you want it, it's, it's the best code, if you like, to, to have freedom, salvation, forgiveness of sins if you come to him. If you want that tract, I'll leave a link in the description uh, and this is what it looks like. It's available uh, globally, it's available in the US and, uh, and in the UK uh, and everywhere if, if you want to get a copy of that. But if you yourself have got a big bundle of tracks uh, that you want to give out and you've always wondered when should I do it, well why not? If, you, if you're not someone who normally goes out and gives tracks, this is really what I want to encourage you to do. Try doing it on this, this Black Friday. Try and get a team to Together. Try and encourage your church to, to go out and share the gospel. Now, something else we did back in 2021, which also worked uh, pretty well, is we also had people going out on their social media pages, on their Facebook, Instagram, uh, I'm not sure if TikTok was that big back then, but they were all talking about their testimony and they, is all they were doing is telling the world, like uh, we read in the Gospels, what Jesus Christ had done for them. And can I encourage you, if you've never shared your testimony online, why not do it on the 29th of November uh, 2024? Why not share it this Black Friday on World Evangelism Day? And if you are going to do that, if you want to be part of this, please do use the hashtag World Evangelism Day, maybe even World Evangelism Day 2024. And, and let's see how many of us can go out there and, and tell people about the Lord Jesus Christ. Wouldn't that be amazing if that started to trend on Black Friday? Not this latest uh, shopping deal or this new camera that you can buy, but, but this wonderful, amazing news that Jesus Christ died for sinners. And then the last thing is, 
if you're feeling, okay, I am a pretty shy person, Joe. I don't think I can go online publicly. That's just not me. Uh, and I also, I don't know if there's anyone I could give out uh, leaflets with, uh, tracks with, I'd struggle with that. Well, why not, why not just use your social media page uh, and take a, a video, a, a gospel video, and share that on your page, in your WhatsApp group, um, on your Instagram, wherever, on your stories, just share a gospel video. You're still part of sharing the gospel if you do that. And again, if you want a video to know uh, which uh, video to share, I've got one that again was was uh, catering particularly for Black Friday. And if you'd like to see that, that's also in the description. And I'll also leave a link, uh, an end screen to it um, at the end of this video. So, Yes, we've done it in 2021. We did it again in 2022 and 2023, but it, it wasn't the same. I didn't give it the same push. So this year, I really hope that we'll be able to revive this World Evangelism Day. Not an excuse not to do evangelism for the rest of the year, but it is a wonderful reason for us all to come together and work together and try and spread the gospel because we are stronger when we work together. So it is World Evangelism Day. Well, actually, not really. It's a week before World Evangelism Day, but the day I'm posting this is World Evangelism Day. World Evangelism Day. For the World Evangelism Day. World Evangelism Day. World Evangelism Day. Happy World Evangelism Day. The World Evangelism Day. For the third World Evangelism Day. So I have the Black Friday deal by uh, Joe Kirby, which explains uh, Black Friday and it gives the gospel. It's really awesome. Got 200 of those. I'd say I have like about 50 or so left. That's, I, I knew about God, of course. I knew about who he was. God bless you all. And if you'd like to see that video about Black Friday, please do click here. If you'd like more information about how it worked in 2021, things will be a little bit different because we are in 2024. You can click here. And if you're new to this channel and you're enjoying these messages, please do click subscribe. God bless you all. And thank you for watching.